Hi everyone, this is Vakas with Mobile Cent Centrix. So I have a question for you guys. So to these shops, we're shipping thousands of these small parts and these shops are getting all types of random parts, LGs and Motorola's and Samsung's and iLink phones. But how are you guys storing these things? I mean, shops must have a night, night like mayor trying to organize this, keeping inventory track of this. And even when the techs need to go out and find these, how do you guys find these things? So us at Mobile Cent Centrix have thought long and hard. And to be honest, we've been prototyping different models and different types, but at the end we found out that, hey, we should go to a very simple so, so, so like Lucian binders. Now, these aren't your typical binders. These binders, we've thought really hard into it. A typical binder, when they have a single clip hook, most parts will just swivel right off and it won't be able to keep the product up, up right. But after we looked at our packaging, we were like, hey, well, there's enough gap hole that if we kept two hooks close enough to each other, we should be able to keep a real existence on the product to actually keep it upright. So we've done plenty of prototyping. We use so many different materials and the best one that we found was a really strong, really soft to, to the touch a product that has a product placement uh, which has a product tag name on the outside and then to be able to fit not just one product but to fit multiple different products on multiple different clips so as you can see there's three rows of binder clips and each row holds about six d-leg binder clips now even these d-leg binder clips we decided not to make them out of paper we made them out of harder plastic so if there's any uh, there should be no damage to the cardboard as well. So as you can tell, you should be able to accommodate hundreds of parts within a few binders. This should make every shop owners and every tech's life much easier trying to find the parts, to organize the parts, and keep the proper inventory of the parts. In a few seconds, I'm going to show you how these binders can be used in a practical use case. Now these binders are super easy to open. We've made sure that they're going to be able to open with a single one hand clip and to easily be able to slide in any product directly into place and to be able to lock it back up. But also we thought that, hey, sometimes shops don't always have one model or one set to fill up a full binder. We thought, hey, well, there should be a reason to have smaller binders in your store. What happens if you just wanted to store only batteries for a particular model? If you wanted to store just a particular IC chips that you commonly use? Well, there's a way to keep smaller binders as well. Another reason to make two binders is to allow shops to organize their stores to their layout. Now, we don't know what, how every shop would want to use the binders within their stores. Some shops might want to keep some of these smaller binders on the tech bench. Some, some, some shops would like to keep the smaller binders at the front counter for a quick access of parts. So leaving two different size binders allows shops to be able to adjust their stores to their needs. Well, these binders look great, but how am I really gonna find a card that's gonna fit into this? Am I really gonna make a sticker that's gonna stick onto these D, D, D like binders? We thought about that. So every binder box, is going to come with a preset of extra cuts of stickers that you can peel off and to apply directly onto the 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 like biters and it doesn't come with one it comes with three each paper coming holding up to 48 stickers and the side dividers not just one it comes with three extra divider paper papers to be able to help you organize your store to your needs if you mess up on one, it's okay. You still got two more. You also won't have to worry about how to print it. Well, at MS, we're, we've made a template file where allowing you to be able to easily write down just the names of it and to be able to stick the paper in the printer and print it out on the A4 sheets. So we at Mobile Centrix now are trying to see, hey, what other parts are there that we can work, we can actually use to help you to organize your stores better. We saw our battery packaging, we, we didn't like it. And as most of you shop owners might have already seen that, hey, we've already started to switch our battery packaging to a much more Rolex bust clear packaging where they all come pre-configured with peg hooks. This allows the shop to keep their batteries stored in a binder. 
no longer needing to separate out batteries in different compartments and to re re like remember which battery goes with what you can label the batteries to what what specs you like so we're thinking about every single way for every single one of you on how this is binder should be able to help you really solve some of your needs mobile centrics it's on youtube facebook and instagram